In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you the top five user rushes in Madden 21 and how you can do all of them. What's up guys, my name's Cody and I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel is all about helping people become the best Madden player that they can possibly become. And so if you're looking to get better at this game, I just wanna encourage you to click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. It's completely free to subscribe and it just allows you to be able to stay up to date with the latest and greatest tips and strategies right here in the community. Now in this video, we're gonna be starting off with tip number five, our number five user rush. And it comes to us out of my favorite defense in the entire game, a defense that I wrote an entire guide on, the nickel 335 wide. If you wanna get access to the entire uh, defensive guide, you can get access to that in the description but the first user rush comes from this one and the way that i like to do this one is i like to audible down into the mike blitz three i'm going to shift my defensive line to the same side as the running back and i'm going to basically put my user kind of right over the guard just like so and i'm going to put him on a purple zone it's really important that you put him on a purple zone um, because you don't want him on a blitz and the reason why is because you don't want the lineman to pick him up obviously so this now the ball you're just going to see i'm just going to run right through the center and as you can see right there we get instant user rush a gap pressure at our opponent so that's the the first or the number five user rush at man 21. The number four user rush in Madden 21 actually comes from the same basic concept, but it comes from a different play, and it's the play cover four show two. And what I like to do is I like to basically shift my defensive line to the right. I'm gonna blitz my user just like this right here. And then this is a very good rush for something like a trips tight end or something like that. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on to Redman here and at the snap of the ball, I'm just going to come right around. So as you look right here, I'm coming right around and getting instant pressure at the quarterback. So same style of user rush, except this time it comes off of the edge. And honestly, that one is a little bit better for trips tight end style of offenses. Now I'm gonna share with you the number three user rush in Madden 21. In my personal opinion, this is a very, very good user rush for a lot of different situations, but honestly, it's probably best against Bunch. It's a very, very effective user rush against Bunch. So I'm gonna share it with you against Bunch here. And it comes to us out of the nickel 335 normal formation. It's actually, you don't really contribute a lot of resources to it and that's what makes it so effective. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come out in the nickel 335 and we're just going to come out in the Tampa 2. If I can find the Tampa 2, that's what we're gonna, so we're gonna come out in the Tampa 2, we're gonna press coverage. And basically what we're going to do is we are going to essentially put our slot corner right here onto a purple zone, just like so. And what I tend to like to do is I'll kind of maybe like move this guy to the middle, just kind of get them to think that I'm using him. But I'm gonna be over here on this guy on a purple zone. And because of the wide stance of the 335 uh, normal, you see that I can basically come around the edge like that and not have to blitz a whole lot of resources. In fact, if you wanna do this user rush, you can actually do it with only two people. You'll see here, I'm only blitzing two people at the quarterback and you'll see I should be able to get around and basically get the instant sack. So that's another reason why I like that type of user rush. So that's the number three user rush. The number two user rush in Men 21 comes to us from the Big Nickel over G. The reason I like Big Nickel over G so much is because it is very symmetrical. It looks, everything looks pretty much identical. It's very deceptive in that regard. And another reason why I really like this this defense is because it just simply does a great job and you don't have to put a lot of resources into it. So I'm just gonna come out and cover four quarters. All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show blitz just like so. And what I'm gonna simply do here is I'm gonna click on to the slot corner. I'm gonna crash my line out obviously. I'm gonna click on the slot corner and basically I'm just gonna run right off the edge as you can see right here. Now the reason, the one thing is again, sometimes with the running back, you wanna be opposite of the running back. So that's kind of one little issue that I have right there. You'll see here that if the running back is on the other side, and I just kind of pinch in just a little bit, I'll be able to get around this time, as you can see, and be able to get the sack. So that's a very simple little way to do it. But the number one user rush comes to us from Big Nickel over G, it's the same formation, except what we're gonna do is we're gonna kind of fake it with this guy right here. And what we're gonna do is we're going to take this linebacker and we're gonna man him up onto the running back. And then what we can do is we can actually drop the line into a bluff blitz just like this right here. And we're just gonna click on to Savage right here. And the beauty of this user rush is it comes in so fast and so clean. Literally, it's, they, they, it's instant pressure. 
instant pressure unstoppable and i want to talk just briefly about the fact that they don't there's so many things you can do with the coverage behind it because of this so what i can do if you take a look i can take this guy i can kind of put him over the center man him up on the running back and then what i can do is i can just get a justy so i could do something like this i could do a hard flat i could do a three rec hook zone and then i could only have and then maybe even i could even literally do a spy i mean we're talking two people and look at how clean this is going to come that comes flying off of the edge this is the exact user rush that Decroft used in the game against Young Kiv was able to secure him uh, a very big time fumble sack fumble and really it's just a perfect user rush it's, there's so many things good about it but the best part about it is you only need to literally send two people you're literally only sending two people and you will literally get instant pressure every single time it's amazing and I would encourage you to mix some of these elements of pressure into your defense and again, if you want to get my preferred way to play defense in Madden 21, my complete defensive guide is going to be available in the description of this video. You can get that for just $15. It shows you how to use all of the user rushes. It also shows you how to build the coverage behind it through video breakdowns, written setups, as well as film study analysis. You are going to learn step by step how to literally build the best defense in the entire game. So I want to thank you for watching this video. And I want to encourage you, if you have not already got the defensive guide, you can get that in the description for just 15 bucks.